The Dalai Lama will visit the United States later this month and plans to meet with President Barack Obama. The meeting is drawing harsh criticism from the Chinese regime, and the Tibetan government in exile has responded. Here's more. The Dalai Lama is set to arrive in the U.S. in two weeks. The Chinese regime has already spoken out in opposition to the visit, saying it could further threaten U.S.-China relations. Spokesman for the Tibetan government in exile in Dharamsala, Thupten Samfel, says the Chinese regime is worried because the meeting will again highlight the Tibetan issue. Uh, I think uh, uh, it sort of uh, indicates that uh, you know that, uh, their nervousness in the issue of Tibet being you know this what they call internationalized, that you know this, the wider world recognizing that there is a problem in Tibet and that China should do something about it. The Dalai Lama will be in Washington, D.C. on February 17th and 18th. He will then travel to California and Florida, returning to India on February 26th. The White House has not announced the schedule for his visit. China's foreign ministry spokesman Ma Xu said yesterday the Chinese regime is firmly opposed to any contact between Obama and the Dalai Lama. He warned the visit could further undermine China-U.S. relations. A Tibetan activist in Dharmasala called the foreign minister's comments ridiculous. I think um, this is another ridiculous thing that China has done. Um, this is a clear sign that they're not ready to, um, to change. Um, you know, they have always been criticizing His Holiness' visit to any country, um, despite um, being an official visit or not. Uh, I think this is just another thing that China is doing, and it's really ridiculous. The conflict over the Dalai Lama's visit comes at a time when China-U.S. relations are already strained. Last week, the U.S. angered Chinese authorities by agreeing to sell $6.4 billion worth of weapons to Taiwan.